The Photoshop Tools preset panel is where you can save and reuse frequently used tool settings. Instead of having to constantly reselect them and apply the settings, you just have a one click option to grab that tool with all those settings applied to it. Now this is what it looks like here. If you can't find the actual panel, you're going to go to the Windows menu and then go down to Tool Presets and click it and it should pop up for you. You might not have anything in here. You might have some already saved in there. Um, but if it's empty, all you got to do is select any tool. Let's just go to Gradient, right? And then you will come and you'll set whatever settings you need to at the top right up here with all these options. And then you're going to come click this drop down here. And every tool will have this drop down for the presets. So once it drops down, you're going to click on this plus sign. And then you're going to name your tool preset and click OK. Then you can see it popped up right here. So every time. If I open up my tool presets panel, every time I open it up and scroll down, look for gradients. So all I have to do is click that once and then it'll have all this stuff already applied to it. Now, if you don't want to see every single thing, you can click this button right here and it'll just show you the presets for whatever tool you have active. So if I go switch it, to the pen tool, you can see it changes. Brush tool, shapes, text. But I like to usually just keep this unchecked. That way I can see all my tools at once. It also has an add button right here where you can add presets also. And then a delete button where you can delete ones. You have to actually have one highlighted or selected to be able to delete it though. Then if you go in the top right to the hamburger menu, you can do a new tool from here also. You can rename tools, delete them. Uh, these three are just how you view it inside the panel. You can either show them all or just show your current active tool presets. Uh, then this section this is for how it looks in the panel. So if I click text, it's not going to show the picture to the left hand side of what kind of tool. I usually just either keep small list or large list. Then you can also reset it or reset all your tools. Then we got the preset manager. If I click this, it opens up the preset manager dialog box. And you can see all your tools here also. If you click on this drop down, you can check out all your contours that you have. You can click on this little settings gear and we've got some other options here. You can show just the text without the little uh, thumbnail picture or you can have it large just like in the panel itself. You can reset and replace tool presets from here also. And then you got crop and marquee or text. And what this does is it replaces the current tool presets with the tool presets from your crop and marquee. And then this will just replace them with tool presets from your text. Then you got other options to reset your tool presets, load them. If you load them, you're going to look for a file on your computer wherever you have your files saved. Then you can save them to your actual computer and you can replace. Convert to brush preset and convert all the brush presets. You had to be on an actual brush one. Then you can convert it to a brush preset and it'll bring it to your brushes panel. And from here you can edit and control it a little better. I recommend if you're going to do a brush preset don't do it with the tool presets. Save it to the actual brushes panel because you got a lot more control and there's a lot more things you can do with it. And after that, you got crop marquee and text. It's the same thing as the other ones that I showed you. And then last but not least, we got close and close tab group. All this does is just close down your panel. 
And that's pretty much it for the tool presets panel, guys. If you got any questions or comments, make sure to put them in the comment section below. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.